non ho ancora bloghi <coughs> Sony davanti una lente planiforme vediamo, vediamo il, un esempio di video, video composizione usando appunto blocchi sonni poi il video editing magic video di lux 7 plus CT premium Titicaca is approximately 13,000 feet above sea level. Mm, approximately. At this great height, many visitors are subject to altitude fever or soroche. The most common symptom is dizziness. Often followed by a palpitation of the heart. Have a tendency to pop. And a peculiar ringing sound is heard. <laughs> Fascinating, isn't it? The balsa or basket boat is constructed entirely of reeds tightly bound together. It's built to withstand the fury of the elements. In fact, it seems to be impervious to practically everything. Except the inquisitive tourists. Crossing the lake is often filled with adventure. A strong wind may arise very suddenly. And then stop suddenly. In the village we find this quaint old bakery where the tourist may loaf around to his heart's content. For the artist in search of local color, The marketplace presents an excellent picture of village life as shoppers and merchants bustle about the public square. The precipitous terrain in this region offers no problem to these hardy folk. And we find the people here divided into two classes. Those who walk against the wind and those who walk with the wind. Yes, wherever the visitor points his camera, he finds a picture fit for framing. The Lama, or Yama, is an odd-looking individual with considerable personality. His master here exercises complete control over him with a homemade flute. Let's see how he responds to a few notes upscale. And downscale. Up. Down. Now to a circular pattern. Or reverse. Wow, wow, wow. It's a mountain. sign language being used by our tourist here is quickly interpreted by this wide awake youngster. The visitor never seems to be satisfied until he tries on the native costume. And our tourist is no exception. The 
llama is obviously not a jitterbug, but if you want to explore this precipitous country, he'll solve all your transportation problems. One soon becomes accustomed to the low, fleecy clouds that steal like silent ghosts across one's path. gentle, undulating gait of the llama adapts itself very nicely to the swaying motion of the suspension bridge. Suspension bridge? Far below us, we see the village. should be cautioned against any reckless behavior at this high altitude. Overexertion is dangerous. And above all, one should never lose one's temper. handiwork as he bids a fond farewell to the land of the Incas, Lake Titicaca.